Yo, what's up everyone? It's the nonchalant Zane and welcome to Decadence. I have been trying to download this game for a while off of Itch.io and I don't know much about it. I just saw it. It looked scary. I said, that's the game for me. And here we are. But before this, can I interest you in joining my Twitch? We already had 13 followers and on YouTube we're on 12. So... Am I going to end up being a Twitch streamer before I end up becoming a YouTuber? Let's see how far we get. But until then, please be sure to like the video, subscribe for more. And let's get into this horror game. It's been a while, so let's let's kick it off strong. Start. I think I crashed the game. Okay, cool. I, Anita, take you, Dean, to be my husband. Dawn. For better, for worse. In sickness and in health. Till death do his part. Oh, yes. I, I remember the premise when I saw the intro picture. It was on the Ichio store page. It showed a woman in a dress. So I'm going to assume she died. Hey, honey. I'm coming home from work soon. Had to stay late to finish. Can you set the table on the counter before you settle in? No, I cannot. I'm about to go and play some games. You have one new message. Hey, honey, I'm coming home from work soon. Had to stay late to finish. Mop it. Set the table on the counter before you settle in. No, thank you. Eat of what? Maybe glasses, cups, plate. Again, honey? You keep on forgetting. I was running late for work. Uh, okay. We'll do it now. Thank you, Dean. I'll be home soon. Okay, you wake up in the morning. You go to the bathroom, right? So that you can take your morning toilet break. Now, where did she put that ring? What? What the? This is the second time this week. I have to clean this up before she gets home. Me personally, I wouldn't take this level of disrespect. Dean, I forgot my keys. Can you unlock the back door for me? How do you forget your keys? Oh, hell no. That's not my wife. There's no sprint, but that's creepy. I don't have an inventory. What the? Okay, so they're pulling a PT. Oh, hey, Dean. Can you clean the mess you left in the living room? She left her books all over the table. What mess? <sighs> Fine. Give me a second. Oh, no. Turn that off. There we go. I think I can go for some fresh air. Yes. Leave 
and never come back. Was that? Can you check it out? Safe to say, guys, I think that we're going deeper and deeper into this mystery. What? Hello. Hi. See you. Dear Dean, I hope this letter finds you well and that you are finding the strength to keep your head up after the last couple days. I wanted to write you today. I am very concerned about your well-being, especially after this romantic event. I cannot feel your pain as much as you do, but please be aware that I'm always here for you as a friend and someone you can lean on. I nearly said you married me, but I'm your friend, bruh. I have not heard from you lately, and I worry that you are struggling to cope with everything. Remember that you do not have to shoulder this burden alone. I understand that someone going through, understand that someone going through what you would find it difficult to take care of themselves, but please. Keep it in mind that we have your best interest at heart and pushing us away will only hurt you more along the run in the long run don't hesitate to reach out your friend at least okay so my wife definitely died i am assuming that she died in a way that was completely preventable and most likely our fault and i think that we either had a situation where we were driving and we got into an accident or she was sick from what the polls show yo dude Get rid of your toilet paper. Wedding photo. June 12, 1982. She died from something. It was either very bloody or very traumatic to him. I am so confused. What did she do? She's just standing there. Menacingly. Oh. Oh. That took a long time. Anita, are you okay? Not now. I need space to breathe, please. You're suffocating me. Let's finish talking. Open the damn door. Bro. I'm sick and tired of your shit. I said leave me alone. What the hell? I swear he was here. I I heard her. Oh. Did she do the thing? With the, the thing? And that's why there's blood on the paper? Because she did the thing? I mean, that certainly would be true. Oh, hell no. I don't want to go out. Dear Dean, we hope this letter finds you well 
We are writing to address a matter that has come to our attention regarding your recent absence from work for six days without prior notice or explanation. As an integral part of our team, your presence and commitment to your responsibilities are crucial for the smooth operation of this company. We kindly request that you provide us with an explanation for your absence during the specified period. This will enable us to understand the circumstances surrounding your absence and explore potential ways to address any challenges you might be facing. To avoid any negative impact on your professional development and the overall functioning of our team, we kindly request that you adhere to, your, to our attendance policy moving forward. We encourage you to schedule a meeting with your manager, Juliet, at your earliest convenience to discuss your recent absence and any underlying concerns you may have. Thanks for your attention to this matter. Sincerely, Arthur. Funeral services, over to you. Sheriff's offices, over to you. He hasn't opened. Oh. That would have scared me if they did it right. Where's the remote? Oh hell, no, switch it on. Was she murdered? The sun. More about and lawsuits. Oh. How? <laughs> I'm out of the game. She's T posing. I broke the game. That's cool. I want to explore this level now. Stupid. Oh, that sucks. I'm trying it again. Okay, I at least know there will be a jump scare at least in one of the scenes. Because there she is. My beautiful wife. Oh, so it's Luke. I did figure it was Luke. Oh, and there's the red room. Did he murder her? Oh, and there's a mannequin. Is this cheating? I feel like it's cheating. Right? That was fun. Let's keep going. Okay, I think I, I understand what happened. Moving day. We took this picture when we first moved here. We're not the first to live in this apartment and we won't be the last, but we'll be the ones who never leave. Ooh. Ooh, that's concerning. Oh, that is... I hope this letter finds you well at your and your family in good health during this challenging time. Please accept my sympathies. And know that my thoughts and prayers are with you and your family as you navigate through this difficult period. As your attorney, as your attorney, it is my responsibility to assist and guide you through legal matters. 
pertaining to your I understand that this is a displeasing and emotionally overwhelming time and I am here to provide you with all the necessary information and support to ensure a smooth and efficient resolution. In the upcoming days, I kindly request you to schedule a meeting at your earliest convenience. This meeting will allow us to discuss the necessary the legal procedures including probate, assess, asset distribution, and other legal matters associating with your wife's estate. During the meeting, I will provide you a comprehensive overview of the steps involved and answer any questions or concerns you may have. Rebecca Smith. So, did he kill her? She's gonna kill me. Hello, baby dearest. Yes, I think he did kill her. I'll take my vows with you now. Don't kill me. Did I kill you or did you die? You look as beautiful as you did four years ago. I'm sorry, Alita. I can't let you go. What happened? We took over forever. Even death could do us part. Forever. What happened? So did she die? Or did he kill her? Did she die from something tragic? Did he kill her? Did she end up being murdered? Okay. That was decadence. I guess I kind of cheesed the game because I found a way to like see into what would happen. I apologize, it wasn't even in my intention to do that. I didn't even know it existed, but now, wow. This, the game is kind of weird, to be honest. I liked it. I'm glad I, I downloaded it, so, but I expected more from the story, to be honest. I thought it was either... Because the thing that led me on to thinking that the husband murdered his wife and probably killed her because of some infidelity he thought she had. Um, don't even know if I said that right. But maybe he murdered her and that's why there is um, police report. Maybe she... Um, did something very bad where she got into an accident, maybe she OD'd on pills, or maybe she had a terminal illness, but I don't know, I liked it. The story could have used a little bit more, the scares were kind of there, the suspense of not having music made it a lot more immersive, because you had to really pay attention, but anyway, thank you so much for watching. If you liked it, please be sure to subscribe, comment, let me know what you want to see next. Please go and check out my Twitch. I stream every Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, and Sunday. Stay blessed and have a great day, night, wherever you are.